Father, can we go to the circus, Father? Father, I would so much like to see the circus, Father. Can I get dressed, Father? Or do I have to go in the nude? Father, why are, you, why are you looking at me like that, Father? Alright, so welcome back to Shining Force 1. And uh, we have this guy again, and uh, nothing new happens. Right, we're going to the circus today. And um, yeah, let's talk to these guys. My son is missing, have you seen him? Nope. Please help us find our son. Alright. I have a favor to ask you. Yeah, you were very pleasant earlier, so sure. Grant it and the ship is all yours. What do you say? Yeah, alright. Turn the other cheek and whatnot. Sorry, I accidentally killed the mic for a second. If you bring him and um, find him and bring him back, my ship is yours. Alright. Um now, finally. So, Stroot, please find my grandson. After that little debacle, I'm going to... Uh, do I need to load up on anything? No, not really. I'm going to give the orb of light to... Hmm, Henri. I need people to have clear spaces. To me as Cranson? Yes, he went in, in the tent and never came out. That's strange. I'll let you in to look for him. Be careful. Some of those peop people look dangerous. Yeah. So what do you think will happen when I enter this? Oh, by the way. I did buy... Yes, he has a spear. Um... Yep, it's a battle. Well, Strood, remember me? You'll soon wish you'd taken my advice in Ultron. And I don't remember what voice I gave her. I'll look it up. Look it up. Come, my pets. Look who's come to play with you. Why, it's the Shining Force. I leave you in good hands, Strood. I have more vital matters to attend to right now. And she fades away. She dies! No, she doesn't die, actually. That would be a good thing. So... Arthur, this is our... The guy we need to work on here. I'm gonna use town here in the beginning to soften these guys up. Oh, I should check the enemies out, by the way. Show you what they're all about. Um, so, these are mannequins, just mm, beaters. Still, it's battle something, six or seven, and they have the same attack as um, the Rune Knights from the first battle. And this guy has Freeze. So yeah, the, the development in that department is very slow. Dire Clown is a bit more dangerous, attack 18, defense 11. And uh, also Giant Bats. And um, the Marionette is extremely dangerous. Freeze level 3 is uh, devastating. His attack is crazy. and Or her, or whatever. So, this is one of the first really challenging battles. Uh, going to try to kill a mannequin. Yes. And uh, let's hope Arthur can gain something from this. By the way, I'm not sure I might uh, do this battle twice for experience's sake. 
Um, there we are. Because um, <coughs> battles coming up from, from this point, they are. They can be a bit tough. Next one, the stuff. So I might want to boost my characters a bit. Uh, I'm kill the pup. Good, but if I do, attack one, speed one, alright. If I do, I will do that off camera, of course. And uh, that means I, of course, won't kill the boss. It's just kill everything else but, but the boss, and you're fine. You have 94 experience points. That is grand. Now blaze you. Oops, she doesn't quit. Nope, that's good. Speed 2, max points 2. And learns freeze. Which is her signature spell, so. Yep. Yeah. Arthur, that is good. A level up for you, I hope. 6 points. <coughs> And Gort. Yeah, perhaps I should use this battle to get everyone to around level 7 or something. Could be a good idea. And Scrooge. Which means I should soft. Uh, take a bit soft with Tao. Gong can heal. Gain a few experience points. Experience. So Luke needs to gain levels and stuff. Uh, 68, so he will need to kill the guy, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, um, and that will be that. But right now I'm I'm gonna play on cam. I'll do most of the battle, um, and uh, when. When I get you, like only the boss, uh, only the boss left, I will uh, reload, and then I will probably turn on the recording once more. While once, uh, <coughs> once I'm in the same position in the battle with only the boss left. How does that sound? I'm just gonna check her XP. Alright, so she can kill a dude, no problem. Thank you. These bats aren't, aren't that bothersome when it comes to invading and stuff, um, compared to later ones in the game, at least. Guys, I'm going to try to put um, people with high um, high HP in front when we go to face the freeze guys. Because, uh, as you might know, magic doesn't care about defense. There is no magical defense in this game. 
There we go. Gonna attack him from here. Don't want to put Arthur at risk. He's he dies quite easily. Yeah, level five, no gains. Woo. <coughs> Luke, will you be so kind? Thank you. Attack one, speed one, max hit points three. That's useful when facing magic users. users. And before before exiting the battle, I will also go to let's just check stats. Um, these chests up here. That is a good idea to pick up what's inside. There we are. So I think level 7 is decent at this point in the game. So that will be my goal. Hmm. Yeah, it's fine. And the marionette won't move, by the way, at all. Not gonna use tile. Gonna go for level grinding, so. much to say here, just a bunch of puppets and stuff. Yeah, in one of those chests, by the way, there is, spoiler alert, there's an arrow for Hans, which you really want. You really, really want it. Um, since he is quite bad right now. So, that's them. I'm going to try to go for the Dire Clowns as well. Loey, you can heal yourself. We'll let you some experience. Thank you. And Chris can't heal any anyone. It's fine. The Dire Clowns <coughs> could move too, but not quite sure where their triggers are. Here. Hans is useful for attacking them, by the way. And also, of course, the Clowns with... Um, or the, the Centaurs with their Spears the ranged attacks because if you go up close to the the clowns you will be in range of the marionettes um, freeze level three it reaches a bit further so Arthur doesn't have any room in his inventory right no he does not uh, Loey does he have any room Yes, he does. So, steel arrow for Hans, that is. Hans Olo. Well, they don't want to come to play quite yet. Yeah, I might, we might as well do this. They have a high defense, so it doesn't do a whole lot, but at least it's something. And uh, 
might as well. Don't think it does a whole lot this this one either. Well, it does actually. It's decent. And um, attack with Hans. This will do one damage, approximately. Two. All right. It's better than one. And um, it's true. That you go there. Can you can attack? This guy. If you be so would be so kind. Well, that's four with a spear. That is actually quite good. Uh, quick attack. Yeah. So since the dark clowns seem to decide they aren't moving either, this will be a bit easier than I first. Thought. I'm gonna give the steel arrow to Hans. I can take the doming doming awake instead. Um, <coughs> and no one moves. Nobody move. Steel arrow attack 19. That's far better. Uh, 69. Giggity. Going to attack the dire clown and hopefully gain a level. Yeah. Yep, attack one. Woo. So now he has an attack of 20, which is quite okay actually. I'm gonna attack with May here. And uh, perhaps I should try to let Arthur kill this guy. Oh well. If Ken can do 4 damage to it, that's all good. Uh, perfect. Attack 1, speed 1, max magic points 1. Yeah? Did you see that coming? Did you? Uh, so now... Luke might die from this, but anyway, he sacrificed his life for 50 coins in that case. Noble sacrifice, if I ever saw one. Um, anyone? No. No one is hurt at all. So, but he doesn't have any magic points, so it doesn't ma matter. Does it now? Thank you. That was unexpected. Um, so, there we are. Uh, I'm going to cast Gress. Um, and then I will meet you up when uh, we are at a bit of a higher level. So. Uh, in a in a moment. All right, so now we are equipped with force, where everyone is at least level seven. Someone, some are level eight, and uh, it has yielded some good results. Hans has an attack of twenty, which is good. Luke also twenty. Uh, Ken has uh, a higher attack. He is equipped with a spear right now, so he's quite mighty actually. Uh, May is lagging a bit, but it's fine. Her attack should be about 19 with a bronze lance, and even Mo even Gong can do a bit of damage. Uh, Loi <laughs> has like the highest attack power in the force right now. Sweet. Um, and uh, Gort has a high defense and a high attack power, and. Uh, so does Stroot. So anyway, now we're going... Uh, well, there is one character character who hasn't reached level 7. Uh, and that is Chris. Because she is apparently cursed. Twice now, uh, on two replays of this battle, I have um, uh, tried to get her to level, uh, to level up. 
but she has um, uh, been double attacked, double teamed in some way both times and it happened just before I started the, re the recording as well. So yeah, there you go. Chris, poor thing. But she's at level 6 and approaching level 7, so it's not that bad. Now, I'm going to be very cautious about how I go about this. This is one of the um, tricky things with this gal, is that she regains HP. She has a defense for 13, which is decent already, but she also regains H HP randomly uh, as the battle pro progresses. I'm going to try to make her move first, there we go, and then I'm going to uh, use a save file. If I do something wrong here, I'm going to um, use as many ranged attacks as I can. Nope, and that is also annoying. She's a bit too difficult, almost. Uh, yeah, with that evasion, she is uh, kind of too uh, not really fun, not really challenging in a fun way. Um, and yeah. Um, anyone hurt? a bit but I'm not gonna put Louis there. I'm actually leaning on leaning on attacking with Louis leaning towards I should say yeah oops almost became the hero of the day there. Gonna leave Gong behind he's not the strongest fighter and yeah, might as well blaze level 2. As you can see, he has regained a few HP and only takes 4 damage from blaze level 2. So they have really thrown everything into onto this guy. High evasion, high defense, regains HP, um, you name it. Uh, high magic defense. Four damage, yeah, it's alright. Yeah, an attack is better than uh, freeze level 3 at least. Um, but the only thing you can do is really just throw everything you have at her at all times. And then you need almost need to be a bit lucky as well. Evasion. Just screw you. Hope she doesn't regain too many too many hit points at this point. No, uh, going to do this. Louis alive. Can you imagine? And Gong, you can attack instead. Not the best attacker. But... Oh, thank you, Gong. You are my hero. I want to lie with you. Sorry. Fool's light will never defeat the darkness. Uh, or will it? She, that evil woman, woman, was going to take me to room for us to feed me to a dragon. Thank you. I'm going home and now. I'm never leaving. Never leaving? I don't think that's what your parents want, really. When you're in your 40s, it's not that... It's not charming anymore. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. And there's an open chest and uh, nothing more. I guess we exit then. And 
Let's see what he says. It's my fault. I should have noticed him there was I should have noticed he was in there too long. Thank you, Shrewd. No worries. I'm sure the mayor is grateful that you saved his grandson. Go talk to him. I will. I will go talking to. He needs a good talking to. Um stop it. Move it. Oh, actually. Let's see if there is a change here. Uh, Shining Force drowns the Room Force Army. Yeah, that sounds better than last time. So. Thank you for waiting. The show will now begin. Please don't hurt me, Shining Force. I changed my ways. Ways, you'll see. I don't believe you. You'll work your evil again. Trat, how did you know? Take this. Ay, you've killed me. Pow, bang, smash. Clap, clap, clap. Okay. Thank you and come again. Clap, 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 clap. We're looking forward to your next visit. I bet you are. I'm gonna go talk to these guys again. This is the worst troll. I should have quit long ago. This is a great troll. I wish I could play this forever. Yeah, told ya. Um, I'm glad it doesn't cost, cost money, by the way. <laughs> but it's kind of a funny thing, that. Uh, going to revive stupid Chris. Um, just so I don't forget. Uh, and now... I'm going to talk to the mayor. Um, can talk to his wife first. I like her. Thank you so much for saving our son. Yeah, no worries. If you need any favors, any other, just mention it. Thank you, Strut. Yeah, shut up. Um, well, not the mayor's wife. That it's this guy's wife. Um, and here's. Thank you for saving me. Yeah, but is it is it right yet? Yeah, right if I take your mother out for for a while here and yeah thank you so much Strut. take my ship it's all yours now right I will so the maze ship is all yours and now we have a ship I think this ship will do just fine Let's gather the Shining Force and leave at once. But... You defeated my pets, but you won't bother me anymore. You're going to burn. Slowly... Slowly... Burn, Stroot. Burn! You'll serve as an example to all who dare oppose Room Fast. Slowly... And slowly she burns the ship. Good riddance, insect. Yeah, I can just walk out of here. Stoop, run. The ship's going down. Yeah, just a minute. I'm just gonna check if, if this fire is spreading or if it's just my imagination or something. I don't really believe in blue flames. You see, it's, it's just normal. Yeah, right. And the ship is burning. And now we don't have a ship anymore. This is bad. That was the only ship in the town. Maybe the mayor can help you again. We'll see. We'll see. I'll talk to him. What? They burnt your ship? Now we have no single ship in this town. The only other town with ships is Urambatul. <laughs> Ulaanbaatar, the capital of Bangladesh, is it? Uh, but it's a long way from here. Are you still determined to go? Yeah, sure. Ulaanbaatar is very remote. It's far to the northeast. Go to Shade Abbey first. Sounds shady. Ask my son all the details about the journey, alright? Head north to Shade Abbey. You shouldn't have much trouble finding it. Yeah. 
Thank you for that detailed description. <sighs> Alright. Well, we're going to Shade Abbey next time. Right now I'm going to, going to finish this set. So thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Ciao!